Hey everyone, in today's video, I'm going to show you the Bright Data tutorial. First, open Google Chrome on your PC and type Bright Data in the search bar. Now, click on the official Bright Data website from the list of search results. Once the website opens, make sure you log it in to your account. If you're not already logged in, use your email and password to sign in. When you're logged in, click on the user dashboard in the top right corner of the screen. Now, you'll be asked to enter a name for your project or zone. Type in the name you want, then check the box to accept the license agreement. Once that's done, click on the button that says, let's get started. After that, look at the menu on the left side and click on the option, call it proxies and scraping. This will take you to a new page. Now, click on the add button to create a new setup. Here, You'll see a list of options including browser API, residential proxies, ISP proxies, data center proxies, mobile proxies, web unlocker API, and SERP API. These options help with different types of data gathering and web access depending on your needs. Scroll down a little and you'll see another section called it Scraping Solutions, which includes tools made for collecting data easily. Right below that, you'll find the Proxy Network section, which shows all the available proxy types. Now, find Residential Proxies and click on the Get Started button next to it. On the next screen, you'll need to enter some details such as the zone name, a short description and select the type of proxy you want to use. Then, click on the Add Country button and choose the country where you want your proxy to be located. Once that's done, you'll see the traffic cost so you can check the price based on your usage. Next, from the left-hand side menu, click on Web Scrapers. This will open up the Web Scrapers library where you can find ready-made tools for scraping websites. In the search bar, type Wiki and press Enter. Now, click on the scraper that appears in the results. You'll see a list of available articles, click on any one that you want to view. A screen will appear asking what service you would like to use. Make your selection, then click on Next to continue. Here, you will see an overview of the scraper and what it can do. After checking that, go back and click on Proxies and Scraping again from the left menu. Now, look to the top right corner and click on Add Payment Method. On this page, you'll see options to add funds to your account and learn about the benefits that come with it. There's also an option to extend your free trial, which gives you access to extra features without paying right away. Now, click on Add Funds Now. You'll be begin a list of payment options such as Credit Card, PayPal, Alipay, Pioneer, and ACH. For example, if you choose PayPal, you'll be asked to enter your email address or mobile number linked to your PayPal account. If you prefer using a card, simply enter your card holder name, card number, expiration date, and security code to complete the payment process. And that's how you can set up and start using Bright Data in a simple way. For more information, check out the links given in the description. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.